My name is Christopher Lloyd, and I am a historian who specialises in telling the history of the universe by connecting subjects together to make the past come alive. My book, What on Earth Happened, attempts to do this in a single volume. And then I thought to myself, what of those people who are interested in these stories but who don't have the time to read a long book on the history of the world? How could I present the information to them? So I thought of another technique for telling giant stories inspired by William the Conqueror and his Bayer Tapestry. This is the What on Earth War Book of Natural History, which has been developed in collaboration with the Natural History Museum. Let me show you inside. This is a four billion year story of life on Earth, from the first bacteria in the sea here, all the way through to the present day. And along the way we see a thousand different species on a timeline. And you can see what emerged in the sea, and on the land, and in the sky, through to the first giant insects, dragonflies, that could grow to the size of an eagle more than 300 million years ago. Along the top is a narrative of life on Earth, and you can see the globe with the land piece, like pieces of a giant jigsaw puzzle, moving together into a giant supercontinent, colliding, and then splitting apart again into the world that we can recognize today. In the center we have the dinosaurs from 220 million years ago to 65 million years ago, where they're wiped out by a giant meteorite strike to make way for the next big force in life on land, the mammals, which radiated into all kinds of different species, but the most powerful one was this Australopithecus, a type of ape that swiveled up onto two feet, and using its freely available hands, it could strike flints together and rub sticks together so its descendants could make fire, turning them into the most powerful species on the planet Earth. And with their freely available hands, they used them to plant crops, to be able to mine, to fish, to be able to build pyramids and castles and cities, turning the world into the world as we know it today. So the What on Earth War Book of Natural History takes you on a giant journey that puts the whole history of life in perspective through a thousand species over four billion years.